Good evening. Hello. Hi, teacher. Hi, teacher. Hello. How are Hi, you? Good evening. Good evening. How are you today? I fine. Thank you. That's tired. Very nice. Are you ready to learn? Are you ready to participate today in the class? Yes. Yes, with a lot of enthusiasm. <laughs> okay, well, good to see you. We only have nine students in this moment. I hope the others connect soon because it's important. It's important to be in the class because you need minimum the 80% of the attendance. So it's important to be in every class. Congratulations to you because you are here. Very punctual. Well, I'm going to share with you right now the screen, the class presentation. Today, we are going to learn adjectives to describe people. Is the class number eight, which means we are in the middle of the course, the middle. Right, very good, two weeks already, two weeks. And it's Monday, July 3rd, 2023. Monday, July 3rd. So, yeah, I don't forget, you have an assignment, a homework. The homework was to talk about people in your family. Also, you will practice WH questions with me and you will learn adjectives which, is, which describe the personality and appearance of people. Okay, WH questions, like to start with WH questions with is, um, and R. Do you remember this was in the conversation, the homework? What's your name? My name is Jill. Who's that? He's my brother. Who are they? They are my classmates. What are you from? I'm from Canada. How are you today? How are you today? I'm just fine. How old is he? He's 21. What's he like? He's very nice. Remember that the question, what's he like? Or what's she like? What are you like? It's a question to ask about the personality of the person. And where are they from? What's real like? So we have the WH questions, who, what, when, where, how, and why. And this is the structure. WH word, where to be, the pronoun, and the complement. And we were practicing last class. Now, um, <laughs> I put here another question that is, what's chalate like? Do we have in the class someone from Chalatenango? Is there someone from Chalate in the class today? No? Is there someone from Santa Ana? Is there a person from Santa Ana in the class? No. Is there a person from Sonsonate? No. Yes. Oh, we have many. Can you tell me what Sonsonate like? What Sonsonate like? Um, it's a... Uh... Como se dice caluroso. It's a hot city. It's a hot. It's a very hot. It's very hot. Yeah, I can imagine. Yes. <laughs> okay. 
especially if you live near the beaches. Right, if you live near the beaches, the beach, Metalio. Eh. Yeah, if you live near the beaches, it's harder. But it's, yeah, very hard. Good. So, are you ready to present your assignment about the people in your family? The homework, la tarea no la hicieron. The homework. Yes. Ah, uh -huh, okay. So you were going to present it. But I think it was in pairs, right? Sí, si se los dejé así, que iban a hacerlo en pareja, y que le iba a preguntar el compañero, o lo hicieron solo, solito. Eh, ah. Yo entendí que íbamos a poner una foto y vamos a hacer las, las preguntas. No yeah. sé si así era. Sí, sí na nadie me mandó nada. Así es que... <risa> Había que mandar, no, Chela. Eh, yo entendí igual que, que ella y yo entendí que ahora lo íbamos, ah, a, presentar. Que ahora lo íbamos a presentar en la clase. <risa> ok, so you are ready. And that's... Ok, yo hago la excepción eh, por mi trabajo. O sea, yo no me quedo chance de imprimir las ventas fotos, pero um, ahí está la tarea. El texto ahí está prácticamente. Se lo mandamos, se lo mandamos por, en el grupo de WhatsApp. Me gusta que lo manden porque los demás se acuerdan que tienen que hacerlo. <risa> y también a veces ya de una sola vez los pongo en la presentación. Pero ahorita si alguien quiere compartir pantalla puede hacerlo. Ya tiene la opción para compartir. Así que Julia ahí puede poner las fotos digitales. Ah, yo lo hice en el cuaderno. Ah, it's ok, it's ok. No problem. Okay. Okay. Sí, es que como digo, eh, o sea, sí lo estoy, lo estoy trabajando el fin de semana, pero me ha tocado bien pesado. Entonces, apenas ya estoy vivo, dicho. Oh, sorry. I know. I had a busy weekend too and a busy Monday. Okay, so I don't know, Miss Karina, would you like to start? You can be number one and Cecilia can be number two. And Julio can be number three. And then we are going to decide the other three, then four, five, six. Okay, Karin, would you like to start? Le comparto la, Please. Comparto la foto. You can share. Yeah, you can share the Pero. picture. Very good. Okay, I'm going okay. to ask you the question then. Okay, Karina, who's that boy? It's my my son. Oh, really? And how old is your son? Uh, he's uh, nine years old. Really? Wow. And you look very young. <laughs> and who's, who's that baby? Uh, it's my little son. So you have two children. <laughs> yes. And what two boys. Do? Yes, two boys. What are their names? Excuse me, teacher. What are their names? What is the boy's name and the baby's and the baby's name? Uh, okay, the boy's name is Mateo, and the little baby is Javier. And how old is the baby? Uh, he's uh, six months. Oh yeah, he's pretty little. Excellent, oh, Karina. Thank you. thank you so much. Applause, please, in the reaction. You can applause. You can applause. Thank you. <laughs> okay, was well, very good. Good. So now it's the turn of Cecilia. 
No sé cómo hacer para compartirle. Eh, ¿Cómo hago? Ahí, a la par de donde están las reacciones. Es, ahí dice compartir. No. Abajo. O oh, a la parte del chat. Ajá. A ver. No, no me sale. Donde, donde le aparece el chat, a la par, está con eh, reacciones. Eh, ahí, ahí hay un cuadrito como con una flechita. Ahí dice compartir. Dice una flechita para arriba. Ajá. Ah. Thank you. Oh, vamos a ver. Ya me metí ahí, pero no encuentro el documento. Aquí creo que está. <risa> Tiene que tenerlo abierto. Ok. It has to be open first. No sé si lo ven. Yes, yeah, Cecilia. Very good. In a moment, we'll see. Sí. <laughs> ok. Eh, yo describí a un padre y una hija, no, no es la foto, o sea, no es de la familia, solamente para ilustración. Exactly, Cecilia. Ok, I'm oh. going to start asking the questions. Cecilia, who's that man? Eh, he is my father. Oh, really? And what's his name? His name is John. Oh, and how old is he? Eh, he's eh, eh, 68 years old. Wow, he's very big. And what's he like? Eh, he likes to travel a lot. No sé si así se pronuncia. Yeah, it's correct. But the question, what he likes? ¿Qué dijimos que significaba? What he likes? Ah, ahí tenía duda porque lo que yo quise poner ahí es que a él le gusta viajar mucho. Ajá, eso uh -huh. es, sí, la pregunta what he likes significa cómo es él. En persona, ¿cómo ah, es él? Entonces sería he, he likes eh, to happy. No, solo sería he is happy. Ah, he is happy. Entonces le voy a corregir acá. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Very good, Cecilia. Plazas for Cecilia. She did a great job. Or do you have more questions? Mm. Tenía más preguntas ahí. No. No, okay. So he's happy. No. And who is the lady? Who is the beautiful lady in the picture? Cecilia, who is the beautiful lady in the picture? Um, I, I don't know. No, no entiendo. Who is? Who is? ¿Quién es? Who is the girl or the woman with your father? Uh -huh. In the picture. In la foto, in the picture. Who is the girl? Who is that woman? ¿Quién es uh -huh. esa mujer? ¿Quién es esa chica? Who is that girl? Uh, he's a... He. He's... She. I know. Ella. She. He. She is a... a my friend. No le escuchamos así, se cortó ahí. She is my friend. My friend. Ah, oh, she is your friend. Okay. <laughs> What's her name? Eh, is, eh, sería he siempre, his name. She's no, name, ¿verdad? A ver, a ver, ¿qué dicen los demás? She's name is uh, sería, Elisa. Sería, perdón, sería her name. Her name. 
is Elisa. Ah, okay. And how old is she? Eh, she, eh, she, no. She is? She is 25. Oh, okay. mm -hmm. very young. And what's she like? What's she eh, like? She's um, eh, happy. <laughs> She's happy too and beautiful. She's very beautiful. <laughs> you can also say intelligent, um, friendly, talkative. Thank you. Thank you. Very good, Cecilia. Okay. Thank you. When you practice, you learn more. I'm gonna share a screen and you will see in the next slide different adjectives with which you can describe people. You can see here, for example, he is really tall. Todos conocemos a alguien que es bien alto. He's really tall and he's short. She is a little heavy, a little heavy, un poquito rellenita. She's a little heavy, but she is thin, she is delgada, she's thin, he's handsome, she's very pretty, they are good looking, she's really friendly, he's quiet, he doesn't talk too much, no habla mucho, he's quiet, but she is talkative, right? She's talkative, um, she's serious but he is funny and she is shy. So different adjectives that you can take notes to describe people, to describe your friends, to describe members of your family. We have an example, my friend John is really tall. My cousin Mary is a little short. My coworker Chris is a little heavy. Examples, right? And we are using the verb to be is Evening. My teacher is very beautiful. Nah, just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. Okay. So now. Yes, you are, teacher. Yes, you are. I'm just kidding, Fernando. But <laughs> thank you. Julio, are you ready? Yeah, teacher. Okay. We are all ears. Um, in this este case. ¿Escucha bien? Yes, we can hear you very okay. well. En este caso estoy describiendo a una amiga que conocí hace un par de meses atrás. Eh, um, y bueno, eh, las preguntas serían de la siguiente forma. Who is she? She is Brenda Vázquez. Eh, um, what is her profession? She is um, an announcer. An no sé qué. Ajá, ya. Yeah. Uh, how, how old is she? She is 30, um, 32 years old. Uh, there did you meet her? I met her at radio. Um, where does where does she work? Um, she worked on the radio station. Um, what is in her favorite food? Her favorite food is a uh, French chicken. And what do what does she like? She likes music, food, and working in the station. Why are eh, bueno in the image that I'm going to yo le estaba entregando un pequeño postre a ella. Entonces eh, la pregunta era, why are you with her in the pilot? Eh, because I have the answer. I have a I had her at the insert. Oh, Postre. a dessert, uh -huh. a dessert. Yeah. Okay, dessert. <laughs> Good. Esa, practically. And what's she like? What's uh -huh. Brenda like? No, eh, it's what does she like? Yeah, what does she like? Yeah, I, I understand. Uh -huh. But I'm asking you, I am asking mm -hmm. you, what's Brenda like? 
Ah, well, okay. How is her personality? Ah, ok. Perfecto. Yo le estoy preguntando. Answer. Answer my question. What's Brenda like? Ah, ah. Um, Brenda is happy. Mm, um, is funny. Ok. Super funny. Um, Brenda is um, short. Ah, uh -huh, she's short. Okay. <laughs> short. Um, okay. Brenda is super cool. Super, super nice. cool. Okay, Julio, you see you are speaking English. Thank you, Julio. Thank you so much. Nada, no problem, teacher. Okay, let's, let's give an applause to Julio. Okay, who else is ready to share with the class? In a few minutes, I will be ready to hear. <laughs> okay, Fernando, we, you can do it. You can do it later. What about Jorge or Ana or Denise or Jennifer or Gabby, Alvin, Christopher, Francisco, Jorge, Edward, Angie? Are you ready to present? Yo lo tengo, pero la cuestión es que mi celular no, no le funciona en la cámara de atrás, entonces, eh, y en la computadora no se le diría bien porque mis letras no están, así que se comprenda. Ah, don't worry, Christopher, but you can read the questions, así como lo hizo Julio, así sin la cámara. Ah, ok, ok. Who's that name? Uh, she, she's my sister. Who's that his name. Ah, no, sí. Who's that? Her name. Her name is Melanie. Who, do, who is she? Her. Eh, she, hola. She. She is. Eh, ¿Cómo que se No me acuerdo cómo se dice 18 años. <laughs> A ver, ¿quién le dice? Eh, eight, no, no, es 18. No, 18, no, no, no. yes, it's 18. 18. She is 18. She, she is 18 years old. What does she like? She is very funny, very fun. She is tall. Y she is hungry. Hungry, hambrienta. Oh, eh, no, no. <laughs> Hung, angry. 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 Oh. Enojada. Sí, tam sí también. <risa> también. <risa> Divertida y enojada. She's fun. She's funny but angry at the same time. Thank you, Christopher. Thank you for sharing. Okay. okay. I'm ready, teacher. Okay, Fernando, go ahead. Oh, Fernando is sharing the screen. Oh, <laughs> very good. Okay, Fernando, who is that girl? She is my friend, no, uh, no Naomi. How old is she? She is 19 years old. Where is she from? She is from Italio. The same city. Uh, ah, this question is interesting. What is she like? She likes too much to drink chocolatina and cookies. <laughs> she likes to drink much. She likes to drink much chocolatina. Much, okay. And it's my, she's my beautiful friend. She, yeah, she's very beautiful. I can see. <laughs> I can see she's beautiful. Okay. Fernando, in the question, what is she like or what's she like? The question means about personality. Como es ella? What is she like? She's, she's a little tall. She's a little? She's a little, a little tall and she's very friendly and she, she is very happy. Very nice. Like you. 
Thank you, Fernando. Thank you for your okay. job. And for the picture of your friend. <laughs> okay, who else is ready? Are you ready, Anna? Anna Vasquez? Hola, ahorita, solo lo comparto. Okay, good. Okay, thank you, Anna. Perdón que no la llevo al micrófono. <laughs> okay, Anna, who is he? He is my husband. Okay, and who is that girl? She is my, perdón, perdón, who is they hear? Yo, yo le estoy haciendo las preguntas. Who is that girl? Usted me da la respuesta. You give me the answer. She is my daughter. Your daughter. Okay. Okay. How are the two of them alike? A, her, they. They have. They are, they. Perdón, que ahí me, 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 me cuesta. They have, they have the same, the same smile. They have as they, as they, they the same, the same smile. A smile. Yes, they have the same smile. Okay. Yes. How is your husband like? Or what is the greatest quality as a husband and father? What is his greatest quality as a husband and father? He is a love, responsible, responsibly. He is responsible. 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 He is the vex. Okay. What's your daughter's name? What is your daughter's name? She is Amelia. She, she is Amelia. She, she is Amelia. She is. Okay. She, and what she is, is your, Amelia. And what is your husband's name? Uh, Julio. Okay, he is he Julio. Is Julio. Sí. <laughs> How old is your daughter, Anna? How old is your daughter? How old? One year, two years? Uh, five? Four. Four. <laughs> she is four. She is a four. She's four. Okay. Yes. That's it. Finish? Finish, finish. Very good, Ana Maricela. Thank you for your participation. Okay. Somebody else is ready? Who else is ready, guys? Nobody? <laughs> you want to continue with the class, right? <laughs> okay, now guys, we are going to practice with this adjective. You are going to type in the chat. Vamos a escribir en el chat. Sentences using this adjective. Okay? 
Vamos a escribir en ejemplos, oraciones usando estos adjetivos, adjectives to describe people. So, for example, you can say, my brothers, this is true. My brothers are very tall. My mom is really friendly. My sister-in-law is very talkative. Um, we can say, my father is serious. Mm -hmm. My husband is handsome. <laughs> right? Okay, Julio Cesar wrote, my friend Brenda is sure, my brother... Ok, Christopher, cuando hablamos de la estatura, usamos short and tall. Short and tall. My friend is very smart, ok. Let's participate, please. The teacher is getting sleepy. Let's participate and use the device. Like teacher. It's late. <laughs> well, before I used to go to bed at 9, 9.30. And now I have to go to bed like one hour later because I, I'm teaching at this hour. But yeah, you know, it's Monday. It's Monday. <laughs> okay, yeah. I'm excited. <laughs> My brother is tall. Very good, Carlita. My cousin is happy. Good, Julio. Just a cousin without the G, just cousin, no G, no lleva una G. My cousin is happy, my cousin is happy, is funny. My friends are small. Sus amigos son pequeños. Están pequeños de edad? O es que decir que son pequeños de estatura? De estatura. Ah, pues usamos short. Short. ¿Cómo se, se escribe, teacher? Here, he is short. Aquí está el ejemplo, short. S-H-O-R-T. Cuando no sabemos cómo escribir, vamos a decir, how do you spell it? How do you spell it, teacher? Okay, my sister is quiet. Francisco no tiene que poner el, el he, no es necesario. So like, my brother is, or my sister is quiet. My sister is angry. <laughs> Sorry, Rosalia. My niece is naughty, yes. The children are naughty. My mother is happy. My family is very funny. Okay. That's nice. More examples, try to use all the adjectives. My mother is funny, my mom is angry at times. <laughs> okay. Chicos, antes que se me olviden, solo quiero mencionarles algo muy importante y por eso lo voy a decir en español. Eh, la semana pasada hubo un, un problema con la grabación de una clase. Eh, creo que fue un error de Zoom o de mi computadora, no sé. Pero no se grabó la clase, con, bueno, sí se grabó la clase completa, pero no pude convertir el video que se sube a la plataforma. Entonces, por, eh, bueno, la decisión que se tomó, es que vamos a repetir la clase. Vamos a tener otra clase más para que estén completas las 16 horas clase, ¿verdad? Que deben, que Insafor pide que estén en, en el canal de YouTube. Entonces, esta semana tendremos clase de lunes a viernes para reponer esa clase, ¿ok? 
Esta semana tendremos clase miércoles. Lunes, martes, miércoles, jueves y viernes. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. Friday. No problem. Mm -hmm. And the next week is normal. The next week, only Monday and Tuesday, Thursday and Friday. Okay, so okay. more, more okay. practice for you. <laughs> so let's read the other examples. My mom is angry. My mother is funny. My mother is beautiful. My brother is talkative. <laughs> and how old is your brother, Jorge? How old is your brother? Because when they are little, the, the brothers, the little kids talk a lot. They are very talkative. Okay, my boyfriend is tall. My son is very funny. <laughs> oh, Denise, you have a son. Okay. Very good. So this is the adjectives to describe people. Let's continue. Try to use all the adjectives. Traten de usar todos los adjetivos, especialmente los que no conocen. Eh, mientras lo hacen, while you continue writing the sentences, I'm going to take attendance for this class. So please say present or here. Um, let's see. Aleida Marilyn Gómez, Lizama. Not present. Alvin de Jesús Cuchilla. Alvin. Present. Ana Maricela Vázquez Guardado. Present. Thank you, Ana. Angie Yvette Romero Cedillos. Present. Ana Silvia Joachín de Escobar. Present. Cecilia Hernández Cárdenas. Present. Clau Christopher Goches Paca. Christopher Goches. Present. Thank you. Claudia Clima Coseballos. Claudia Climaco. Oh, she's not present today. Coach, no me he a mi José. What's your name? Alvin Cuchilla. Sí, sí. Ah. Se me fue la onda. Ok, Claudia Clímaco. Daniel Larisa Romero. Pero no me va a poner falta usted. No. Dania. Daniel Larisa. Eh, David Ernesto Tolosa. Mr. Tolosa. Denise Rosalía Cal Her Hernández. Present. Thank you. Edward Steven Pérez. Present. Okay. Emma Emily Susana Ramos. Emily Susana Ramos. Emmanuel Eliseo de León. Manuel Eliseo. Fernando Enrique López. Present. Um, let's see. Francisco Javier Cortés Aguilar. Present. Gabriela María Reyes. Present. Glenda Baños. Present. Mm -hmm. Hacel Beatriz Abarca. No, Hacel no está. Jacqueline Janet Guzmán. Jacqueline Janet. Jennifer Ivonne Pérez. Jorge Arquímedes Beltrán. Present. Jorge Ernesto Martínez. Present. 
José Adalberto López Castaneda. José Adalberto. Mencioné a Jorge Ernesto Martínez, sí, ¿verdad? Sí, yes. present. Ok. Ok, José Adalberto es que no está, ¿verdad? Me estaba confundiendo. Josephine Esmeralda. Julio César Reyes. Here, teacher, present. Okay. Julio Echeverría. Carla Navarro. Present. Y Carla Lucía Rosa. Ok. Ok, we have the mo more sentences. My girlfriend is beautiful and angry. I'm sorry for that. <laughs> my son is funny. My father is really tall. My cat is affectionate. Yeah, my cat is too. And sleepy. My mother is a smiley. Is a smiley. My father is handsome. My cousin is really tall. My grandmother is affectionate. Okay. Their cat is really smart. So now I know uh, a little bit more about your family, your family's personality. How's, what's your family like? <laughs> okay, very good. So we're going to continue now after writing the sentences, the rest part. We have more adjectives here to describe character and personality. We have attentive, like all of you in the class, calm, intelligent, faithful, pessimistic, friendly, good temper, good temper, happy, hardworking, like my hard mom. Hardworking. Yes, honest. Nervous, humble, Nervous. lively, I believe, obedient, obedient, optimistic. optimistic. Mm -hmm. optimistic. You can also use, you can also use these adjectives to make up your sentences. Mm -hmm. Yes, everyone. Este, es live, ¿qué significa? ¿O oh, qué es? es ¿Cuál, ¿Cuál es? Live. Lively. Lively. Uh -huh. Sí, yes. Ok, it's a, it's a very like, it's the opposite of shy. Lively is a person like, likes to, go, likes to go out, likes to travel. Es an enthusiastic person. Es una persona muy, ay, ¿cómo decirlo? En español. Muy. I, I don't know in Spanish, but. Uh, ¿Entusiasta? Ok, entusiastic. Extrovertida, no. Extrovertida, ok, un poco. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Sí, but. It exists the word extroverted. Extroverted. Okay. But lively is a, sí, a Es como, lo, no es una persona aburrida. No es una persona muy viva, que le encanta salir, a hablar, pasear. ¿Puede decirse jovial? Jovial. Podría ser. Uh -huh. Dinámica. Ok. What, what, the, what the meaning of faithful? Faithful. Faithful is a um, persona muy fervorosa, con mucha fe. Faithful. Ajá, miren, dices. 
lively, full of life and energy, active. Esa es la palabra, una persona activa, lively. O animada. Very good. Can I go to the next slide? Can I pass to the next slide? No yet, please, not yet. Not yet, okay. Do you know someone intelligent? Yes, you teacher. And you, all of you are intelligent too. Okay, what about, do you know someone hardworking? My mother is hardworking. Me. You, Fernando is hardworking. Okay. Yeah. Do you know someone who yeah. is, sorry? ¿Quién dijo yo también? Edward. ¿Cómo se dice yo también en inglés? How do you say yo también en inglés? Me, me, me too. Me too. Me too. Me too. ¿Y cómo digo yo tampoco? Ex me neither. Ex me neither. Me neither. Yo tampoco. Me too. Yes, Yo me también. Yes, me, me too. Me neither. Me neither. Me neither or me neither. Me neither. Me neither. Me neither. Okay. Do you know someone who is nervous? Do you know a nervous person? Yes, please. <laughs> Thank you, Denise. Okay, let's. Can I continue to the next slide? Yes, Miss. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I will try to to send you this slide. Okay, so this is the structure, very easy subject. The verb to be is, am, um, or are in the adjective. Samples, we are gonna make the examples. Ustedes ya los escribieron. We can say, for example, My students are intelligent. Okay? ¿Por qué estoy usando are y no is? Because it's plural, exactly, it's plural. My students are intelligent. Julio is talkative. No, I'm just kidding. No, 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 it's not Julio, it's Fernando. <laughs> He likes to participate, right? <laughs> we can say, for example, Cecilia is happy. We can say Karina is friendly. Mm -hmm. Those are examples. Okay. So don't forget, subject, verb to be, and the complement. Okay. 
Okay, this is the activity that it was the assignment. And I don't know if somebody else wants to participate. Alguien más está listo para participar? Yes, teacher. Oh, that's great. Yes. Very good. Okay, so who goes next? ¿Quién va ahorita? Mm -hmm. Edward, are you ready, Edward? No, he's nervous. You are nervous. You can say, I am nervous, teacher. I am nervous. I am nervous, teacher. Don't worry, we are learning here. I will help you. Can you start, Edward? Yeah, me. Ya no le escuchamos a Edward. Edward, Edward, Steven, I don't know if you can repeat what you said because we didn't listen to you. No, no lo escuchamos bien, Edward, como que se cortó, no sé si puede. Can you repeat, please? We are waiting. We are impatient. We are anxious, Edward. Oh. Okay, maybe he's having problems. Oh, se trabó. Okay, don't worry. Edward. Somebody else is ready to present? Alguien más? We have just a few minutes before we go. Yes, teacher. I am ready. Okay, Karina. Aunque okay, Karina ya participó, va a decir las oraciones, the sentences. Ok. Uh -huh. ¿Cuáles cuál es oraciones? Las que estamos a, a, haciendo sobre... Describir, para describir a las personas, describing people. Las que pusimos en el chat. Yes. Ok, iba a compartirnos. No, no le entendí entonces. <ríe> ¿Y qué pensó que íbamos? Yo pensé que usted nos iba a preguntar. Ah, ok, don't worry. No. Les estaba pidiendo los que de la tarea, los que faltan de presentar su tarea. No, yo pensé que era de la clase. Sí, no sé si alguien más está listo to present your homework, your assignment. We just have a couple of minutes. Albi, no sé si usted quería participar. ¿Pero es de la tarea que ya hicimos o qué? La tarea de describir, de la foto, the questions, the pictures. Ah, no, no sé, ya lo hice, ya lo hice, ya pasé. Uh -huh. Todavía hay algunos que no han pasado. Yo, yo pensé que, me estaba, que, que íbamos a leer el, el parrafito que se había puesto ahí, el, de, el del ejemplo de ese. Oh, don't worry. Bueno, na nadie entonces. De los que están presentes. Participate. <ríe> bueno, chicos, recuerden que las, las actividades que les dejamos son para que ustedes practiquen y aprendan. Uh -huh. Gracias, really señor. El viernes, el viernes este, venía bien cansado y me metí a la clase. Entonces, ya como la mitad de la clase porque me quedé dormido y ya no la... Ya no sabía que había tarea para hacer esa noche. Entonces me dormí y yo, y yo creo que me puso falta, pero sí estaba y del cansancio que tenía que me dormí, la verdad. 
We can say Alvin is honest. Alvin is honest. <laughs> we can make that example. <laughs> Thank you for your honesty and your sincerity, Alvin de Jesus. Don't worry. Okay, guys. So today we study uh, adjectives to describe people. Let me see if I can find um, a listening exercise. Mm -hmm. Yes. I have an, an exercise that I'm going to share with you right now. And you can also listen to the pronunciation of the words, of the adjective. Listen and repeat. Page 21. Exercise 9. Word Power. Describing People. Part A. Listen and Practice. A. Pretty. B. Handsome. C. Good Looking. D. Talkative. E. Friendly. F. Kind. G. Funny. H. Quiet. I. Serious. J. Shy. K. Short. L. Tall. M. Heavy. N. Thin. Okay, guys, so it's important to learn vocabulary. And this is very basic vocabulary, okay? Tomorrow, I'm going to make a dictation of these words. So please study, study the, the vocabulary. Okay, now guys, let's do the, the, the exercise here. It says, complete the chart with words from part A, up to more words to each list, then describe your personality and appearance to a partner. So one thing is, is person, adjectives for personality, and we have adjectives to describe appearance. So what are other adjectives to describe personality? What are the adjectives for describing personality? For example, we have talkative. Friendly. Friend. Funny. Yes, funny. Shy. Shy. Serious. Okay, serious. Quiet. Quiet. Mm -hmm. There's another one. What about kind? Kind, amable, kind. Okay, what about adjectives for describing appearance? Heavy. Pretty, good looking. handsome, good Home. looking. Tall, short. 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 short, heavy. Heavy is ding. 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 Yeah, I think those ones. Very good. So now, can you tell me your personality and appearance? Esa va a ser su tarea. Describe your personality and appearance. And this is the example. I am tall, friendly, and very talkative. I am tall, friendly, 
and and shy. <laughs> Sometimes I am shy. Teacher, how do you spell appearance? Appearance, you can see here. A P P E A R A N C E. Appearance. Mm -hmm. Okay, now the last Thank exercise. You. In the last exercise, we are going to say, wow, who's that? You will listen to three descriptions and we are going to check two correct words for each person. So let's listen. Nora is tall, pretty, quiet, or talkative. Taylor is funny, pretty, handsome, or serious. Austin is short, serious, talkative, or tall. Page 21. Exercise 10. Listening. Wow, who's that? Listen to three descriptions. Check the two correct words for each description. 1. Wow, who's that? Who? The tall guy? No, the very good-looking girl over there. Oh, that's Nora. Is she talkative? No, she isn't. She's really quiet. But she's very nice. 2. My new classmate's name is Taylor. Oh, cool. What's Taylor like? Oh, very funny. Nice. And is she good-looking? Yes, he is. He? Is Taylor a guy? Yes, he is. Sorry. 3. Who's that short guy over there? That's my brother, Austin. He's very talkative. Yes, he really is. Is he serious? Austin? Oh no, but he's really funny. Okay, did you get the answers? So Nora is quiet. Nora is quiet. And what else? <laughs> Listen again. Wow, who's that? Listen to three descriptions. Check the two correct words for each description. One. Wow, who's that? Who? The tall guy? No, the very good looking girl over there. Oh, that's Nora. Is she talkative? No, she isn't. She's really quiet. But she's very nice. Okay. Two. My new class. So, what is a um, synonym for uh, good looking? Pretty. 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 Yes. So she's pretty. pretty and quiet. Okay, what about Taylor? Taylor is funny. And? Serious. Serious. Let's listen. Mate's name is Taylor. Oh, cool. What's Taylor like? Oh, very funny. Nice. And is she good looking? Yes. He is. He? Is Taylor a guy? Yes, he is. Sorry. <laughs> Three. Who's that short guy over there? That's my brother, Austin. He's very talkative. Yes, he really is. Is he serious? Austin? Oh no, 
But he's really funny. Okay. Outing is short and talkative. Talkative. Okay, for Austin, short and talkative. And Taylor is funny and? Handsome. 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 Okay, good job. Well, guys, it's time. It's time to go to bed. It's time to rest. <laughs> I'm sorry. Well, guys, we'll see you tomorrow. Okay. Okay. Bye, teacher. Good night. Bye. Teacher, see you tomorrow. Good night. See you tomorrow.